So based on um, Melinda Strauss's recommendation, I ordered this multifunction phone holder box to make it easier to do TikToks as well as YouTube. Um, so I'm excited to dive in here and get it together. Here's what it looks like out of the package. I am not very good with electronic things, so hopefully I can um, figure this out. Okay, so this is the light, I guess. And then this is what I wanted, the phone clamp, so I could take over shot, shots. <laughs> um, and it plugs in for the light. All right, got it plugged in. Oh, ooh, oh okay, okay, okay. And my, um, can I just say that my oven stove thingy is clean? Do not buy black appliances unless you want to clean them like three times a day. And as soon as you do, anything that's floating, the dust, whatever, will show up on it. But anyway, so this spins around, can move your phone. So this will be fun to do my um, like mini unboxings on the TikTok. So thanks for the recommendation, Melinda. I will also add this to my Amazon store. Since I do like it, I'll put it in my uh, household favorites and that link is in my bio. Hello everyone. It's been a while since I've opened up any mini brands balls, but I'm back with another Disney store ball. I've been sick. I'm still um, getting over a terrible cold, not the Rona, but a cold. Um, and of course, watching everything going on in the news with Ukraine, which I'm always debating whether or not to create any kind of fun content, but I need a little bit of a mental break sometime and I know other people do too. So with that, we'll see what we have um, in this ball. Boom, ish. <laughs> okay, let's dive in. It's also the first unboxing with my new tripod, tripod, tripod system. Ooh, it's Belle. I'm not sure I have her. At this point, if it's not Elsa, I'm confused as to who it is. It's another shelf. The shelves are starting to pile up because I haven't put the last few together. Oh, come on, come on. We need Grogu. And it's another of the cameras. I saw somebody with a Grogu. And people started selling little Grogu. Oh, 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 oh my God, there he is. Oh Finally, freaking little thing. Where you been? Oh, he's in the little bag. Tram, pram thing. But I finally, finally. Oh my gosh, I had almost given up hope. Okay. I don't care what else is in here. It's all gravy after we got Grogu. It's another Tinkerbell. But all we care about is, oh, Grogu. Oh, it's so cute. No, I better get more. One's not enough. I need more. And I have so many more of these to open. So if you're not already, make sure to like and follow. Lots to catch up on and, that I've missed since being sick. Ah, so cute. Come toy shopping with me at Five Below. It's been a while since I've been in here. This is what a rolling basket looks like, but I got a cart, lots of Easter candy, tons of jelly beans, as you can see, cute little benches, Fierro Rocher giant egg, more jelly beans, so many jelly beans, and these super cute fruity pebbles, bunnies and a Rice Krispie one. Lots of Peeps merch, tons of basket stuffers, these little toy mini brands in the bag, some real littles. I got two of these little princess teacups. I'm going to open them here. Squishmallows. I came, this is what I wanted, the up squishmallows. You could only get four. Got some dog toys here. I grabbed one thing for my puppies. Lots of mugs, of course. Still have lots of the Friends mugs and then the Schitt's Creek mug. More plush. I grabbed two of these Care Bears because they're just so cute. Add to the collection. And then these Disney ducks, I couldn't resist. Um, Barbie everywhere. Lots of Barbie accessories. These usually end up at Dollar Tree, I find. 
these Barbie, um, or I'm sorry, Disney doll heads. You can do their hair. So many crafts, so many crafts. Crafts and puzzles, puzzles and crafts everywhere. These mini brand bags had three inside, which was interesting. Better deal maybe than the ball and less packaging. I just thought these were cute, these little kitten cafe. I didn't get one. More Barbie. All the blind bag stuff. It's kind of hit or miss depending on what store you go into. And me deciding, do I need any of this? That was so cute. I did grab the storables. Um, these I've never seen before. I didn't get any, but again, everything is just so darn cute. These I did get, these Haribo little plush, and they smell. So I got those. I think I'm going to just keep them in the bags um, just to collect and save. This smells so good. Lots of Funko. I got five from the office and two from the Mandalorian. I was only able to find one baby Grogu, um, but I got five, like I said, from the office. These are the ones I got. And then I got a Mandalorian and a Grogu. Always have to look at the stickers. And again, books, 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 books. So many books, how many books, so many books. Okay, I had to get it. It was a Grogu lip balm, all the candy, all the candy. Where was this store when I was growing up? I would have died so much candy and again more candy this was funny i'm gonna zoom in here this gummy coca-cola and we have those mints we've got more peeps an icy notepad and erase come shopping with me at aldi there i have my bags got my quarter for my cart here's what the store looks like as you go into it this is the store in waterloo iowa i was here looking for things that my dad would eat he loves those cookies uh, they had some of the candy grapes, so I got him a pack of those. Also got him some watermelon, and they had these Panera soups. There's the single serve kind. Um, I did get a couple of the baked potato for myself. Here I am looking for cheese, and I'm gonna get these little cheese snacks. Um, if he won't eat them, I will. Parmesan was on sale, got a couple of those, and then this one looked good. I've been wanting to make lasagna, so grabbed a couple of ricotta, and now I'm looking for my spinach dip. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. This stuff is so good. Tastes like the stuff at the Grand Floridian Disney World. Now I'm looking at these um, nut bars. I'm trying to find a couple for my dad. Got him the cashew and the peanut. I saw people on TikTok getting these pretzels, so I got one of each, the savory and the sweet. Now I'm looking for things to uh, dip into the spinach dip. Got the blue corn chips, got these naan. Um, I've never had naan, I don't think. These candles, I wanted to smell, but there were two older ladies there who were like sticking their noses in all of them, and I just really didn't want to follow in their lead, but I did get another essential oil uh, for my bedroom diffuser. These black bean chips were delicious. I ate the whole bag in like one city. Uh, there, and then I dropped that bag, so that was awkward, but sorry. Um, and then here I clearly didn't turn the camera off, and now we've straightened up. This is really bad filming, but what you gonna do? And now I am in the aisle of fun um, with everyone and their mother. This, uh, I don't know what Aldi was thinking here with these planters, they're just creepy. Um, then they had planners, the 2022 planners, I love these planners, but due to supply chain issues, they just came out here in March. And we've got mugs, and we've got blankets, and this was super cute. Nice for a small little like bathroom section. Uh, lots of organizing stuff this week. Rugs. Every store is different in terms of the supply they'll have, so sometimes not everything in the ad is in the store. I was looking for the Disney Squishmallows, but... This tiny little bench, I don't know whose tiny little butt would fit, but whatever. Baskets and more storage stuff. Um, soup mugs. And I thought these were pretty. If you want to bake a pie. I got these kind bars for myself. And then I love just the rye chips. And now I'm in the Isle of Fun food section. Looking at all the different things. And the cereals. Lucky Charms, like and follow for part two. This is part two of my Aldi shopping trip. Here you can see what I had in the cart. Uh, I got those cookies and then I was looking here in the aisle of fun. Apparently Aldi has makeup now. My store only had primers. 
these wax melt bars look nice. Here I am wondering if this car cover would cover up my tractor. I uh, didn't get it, but these wine glasses were pretty. I didn't get them, but I know people on TikTok are loving them. Then we have more cables and cords and planners. And it's just the Isle of Fun is mesmerizing yet overwhelming. I go in there, I go out. I go back in and look again and then leave. Now we have fuzzy, plushy stuff. Um, there the grandmas are down there, literally touching every single item. I spotted this here. They're smaller bags versus what you get at Sam's Club. That stuff is so good. If you've never had it, the caramel cheese mix. And I was looking at all these cereals. There was like a Cheerios nut that people have been showing on TikTok. My store didn't have them. They all these Dunkin' Donuts coffee cereals. Um, and then of course the Lucky Charms. I don't know why I showed these on camera. I didn't get them and I don't know what they were, but whatever. Uh, I did get some of the, uh, this pasta. Oh, this would be good for when I make um, maybe stroganoff. Grab one of those. And I was looking in the fridge freezer section. They like have their monthly specials. This was the St. Patrick's Day ice cream things that they had. Um, lots of frozen appetizers. I didn't get any of this stuff. I was just trying to show something on camera because I was trying to hide out honestly in the corner of the store because it was busy. I was overwhelmed and I said I would make a part two and here's the part two and I'm like, what do I show now? So more of the frozen food stuff, a lot of fish things, pastas, none of this honestly looked any good to me, so I'm showing it for you and biscuits, what else, the pizzas. I needed some ice cream, we don't have any. And I saw that these were like premium specialty, so I got a chocolate and vanilla, and then I spotted the macaroons, and they were on sale, like a whole 30 cents off. So of course I had to try those. And then I'm going back over here. Now is the point where I'm like, I really would like to leave, but did I see everything and get everything I wanted? Maybe I'll go down the aisle of fun again. Oh, I spotted these unicorn cookies to show you with the marshmallow, fruity marshmallow inside. They, I was thinking about maybe if my dad might like these cereal bars, but then I decided he probably would not, so I didn't get any. And then I'm going to go over here again wondering what I'm doing with my life and realizing now I have to go to check out, which is always so stressful. But there is a look at my cart and my latest trip to Aldi. I am back with another Zuru Five Surprise Disney Store Edition Mini Brands Ball. Let's go. Boom-ish. Now, if you saw my last video, finally got little baby Yoda Grogu, the little backpack pram one. So now I'm greedy and I want more. Oh gosh, gotta get the scissors out. I'm also filming on my new tripod, so let me know what the, you think of the angle. Okay, we have Spider-Man mask. This is a duplicate for me, for me. And it is another, this is Captain Marvel. What is that thing on her head? I think I've wondered this before. Is that supposed to be her hair? That yellow thing, like, what were they thinking? I don't know. Anyway, next up we have, oh, finally, I got Stitch with his little surfboard. This is the last one I needed to complete the case. Okay, and two more in this ball. We have a Forky. He is so freaking cute. I still haven't watched Toy Story 4 because I don't want to cry. Enough crying going on in the world now. And another of the little baby Tinkerbells. Okay, let's get into the case and we can put the final one in. As you can see from the ledger here, it is the stitch. He's my first stitch and he'll go in the case. So now my case is complete. And if you're new to the mini brands, the Disney series, these are currently um, being sold, I think, only at Target. You can also get them online at Target.com. Um, so anyway, my collector's case is complete. I am back with two Disney Dorables sneak peek boxes, and these are both Series 6. Ah! Each of these boxes has either two or three little ones in it and this one oh this one has three so first up we have 
Captain Hook. Next up, we have another, is this another piglet? Yes, but he's so cute and he's fuzzy. Ah, it's so cute. And then the green packaging. We have a, another dwarf and I think this is Doc. I think those are glasses. Sometimes I think they're tears and it's sneezy, but pretty sure that that is Doc. So Doc and Captain Hook and Piglet in that box. And see how many we get in this box. And this box has two. First up, we have another Ariel. I think there's two different Ariels in this series. So she, this is the one she's in the green dress. And then we have another of the seven dwarfs and it's my favorite, it's Dopey. Look with the little Snow White kiss on his head. So yay, two more. I love Dopey, so cute. I am back with another Zuru 5 Surprise Disney Store Edition Mini Brands Ball. Let's go. Boom. Oh, ish. All right. Ugh. We have, ooh, another Buzz Lightyear, but always a fun one. I love how, like, even in the back, it has the little tab to keep the Buzz Lightyear intact. Um, if I get enough of these and I might open some up. I know people do that, but I, I'm i always reluctant to. I like to keep things intact, but some of these with such high detail. Okay, we have another Captain America. I say another because it's, to me, it's another. And I want more Grogu's. More Grogu's. It is Bo Peep. Another super cute, highly detailed one. I really hope there's a series too with these and we get even more characters and just more Disney stuff. Oh, another shelf. Got four shelves now backed up that I haven't made. Sorry for the sniff, cold. And oh, oh no. It's Princess Leia without a mouth. Not sure what's going on there. I think she and Minnie Mouse came from the same factory. We got Mad Minnie and Leia no mouth, but that's this ball. I am back with two more Disney Dorables sneak peek boxes, and these are both from series six. These little sneak peek boxes have two to three inside of them, so this one has two. All right, first one looks like this is Wendy from Peter Pan. And then this one is Sebastian from The Little Mermaid with his very metallic-y, glittery eyes. And can you hear my pug puppy Teddy barking in the background? <laughs> okay, let's look at the second box, see how many we're going to get, and two more. First up, we have... I believe this is Sleeping Beauty. Pretty sure, I'll have to check the ledger, but these are the jeweled ones. They've got the little jewel dresses. And then another of the Seven Dwarfs. And this one is, I think this might be, I don't know, Happy? Maybe it's Happy, there's a little happy face. Some The dwarf ones are kind of hard to tell apart, to be honest. All right, we have the ledger out. So this prince, oh, no. I was gonna say that's Rapunzel, but this one has a crown. What's going on? Oh, okay, sorry, it's Aurora. I couldn't see because the yellow in the crown on the photo was blending right in. Couldn't tell. And this is definitely happy there and of course Wendy is easy whoops Wendy's easy to recognize and Wendy has a blue dot on her and that says that she is ultra rare you're ultra rare Wendy and Sebastian from the Little Mermaid that's a common so super rare common 
Um, Aurora here is purple, so special edition, and happy is a common one. So which one of these four is your favorite? I like the Windy Doll. Um, Peter Pan the movie terrified me, but I love Peter Pan the ride down at Disney World, so I'll go with Windy on this one. Yes, I'm back at Aldi again, but this is a different Aldi. This is the one in Cedar Falls, Iowa. It's next to Blaine's Farm and Fleet. They newly built this. It replaces the one on University Avenue. It's my first time here. Of course, I had to get a cart because you never know what you might find. Order. And the cart cleaning station was nice and stocked here. And then we enter, and it is so nice and bright and clean and new. Right into the produce area, which is different from the other store. There's a look at the front of the store. I got here before school let out for the day, so it was relatively quiet. I got my dad red grapes at the Aldi yesterday, but here they had the cotton candy white grapes, so I got him those. Now I'm looking at the bread and pastries, same selection as the other store, but I did get this French baguette because I am going to make lasagna. I keep saying that, but I swear to God, I am going to make it. Now I'm looking for the black bean chips that I got yesterday because I already ate the other ones and I want more. And then I found myself in the cheese aisle, so why not get some Parmesan and another spinach dip since I'm here because it is the best thing ever. And now I'm in the household and cleaning aisle, which seemed a lot bigger than the one at the Waterloo store, more better stocked as well. And then I'm in the aisle of fun and I came for two things, two Squishmallows that they um, put out this week and I found number one, which is a Dumbo. And then I found number two, Donald. Those were the two that I wanted. They had some princess ones in there. Then I start looking around at other things. There's these Squishmallow neck pillow things. They only had the one box of Squishmallows at my store. I got this book here, the Cinderella book for my niece Sophie. More of the storage baskets at this store, but they were a lot better arranged, more of them. Daddy's candles for St. Patrick's Day, all of the green and the gnomes. Luck of the Irish. And then I was just showing this stuff because I thought it looked interesting. Fancy candles, Christmas candles on clearance. Oh, and then I did go back and I got this Squishmallow for my niece Sophie too, to go with the book for Easter. These straws looked nice. More things that looked nice. I did not buy any of this, but I just was showing you how nice things looked. I thought these were weird. I feel like if you eat that, the blue dye will make your poop turn green. Um, then I'm over here where the alcohol and frozen food is an odd combination. I've been looking for French dough sticks everywhere and this store had them. So I got a box and I'm so excited. When will I actually eat them? Who knows, but I was happy to find them. Now I'm back looking for the black bean chips. <sighs> I can't find them anywhere. Here's some more cute stuff I wanted to show you and those weird animal planters. And then does this aisle have my black bean chips? No, but finally another end cap. I finally found my black bean chips. These are delicious. And there's my cart. I got everything I came for. Yay.